Hello and welcome back to your friends, it's me Odo and we are back in our Civ 6 um, game with the Kree uh, we are quite strong I believe not militarily but economically at least and we've got astronomy which is good because it gives us the inspiration for colonialism which will be done with us now two turns sooner yay we also got the inspiration of opera and ballet we have built something probably a new museum yep As the city-states normally are in the, along the coast, we could probably find them with... So... We should build a street up there or up there. Hmm. One one four one and this one is one one four one four point five. We could also do trade to Kabul or Mohenjo-Daro. Oh, let's begin the route there. Yeah, you'll stay there. We'll make another camp. We need more housing. We can purchase another parcel. This is great. Let's purchase another parcel. Let's do gunpowder. some industrial nah probably not <laughs> let's build a harbor yeah that's good because one of our city states wants a harbor anyway so that would be great Don't sell this. At least not until we are oh, stupid. The Kilva Kisivani, which is, which would have been great if we had it. Let's see. Is it possible to get through there? Nah. Hey, there is another city-state. The civilization is the first to reveal a tile in every vertical line of the map. This forms a path around the world, even if the path does not end where it began. Yay, five points. That's great.
Hey! Stands on deck spyglass to eye as the enemy ships sink to the ocean's deep. Deaths. Ha 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 ha. Great. Let's move to the sea again. Let's move there. Let's just stay here. Really? Plus 20 religious strength. Well, let's take this one. They want a, a cavalry? Really? We do have cavalry. Antioch. So we are nearly done with this dark era stuff in the next era. Great. Let's build a shipyard. Destroy another ship. True. A lot of destruction here. The Apostle. Let's see. Two times. Yeah, let's take this one. Caravel will have will get the uh, what's it called? Yeah, whatever. You know what I mean. They will get it as well. So Madrid. You were going to Madrid first. How about now going to Misanabi, Misanabi. So, what are you doing next? You've got the uh, We could build a campus, theater square, industrial square, commercial hub. Hmm. How about the campus? Like here. Why does the campus get more science if it's besides mountains? I really don't understand that. <laughs> Probably I should understand it, but I really don't do. We need more traders. least we don't sell it colonialism the enforced spread of the rule of reason but who is going to spread it among the colonizers <laughs> Anthony Burgess I believe that's the guy who was um, uh, doing an investigation on the um, on the Belgian Congo which was uh, terrible because the Belgians were really terrible uh, colonizers. We get a Raj plus two science, culture, faith and gold from each city-state. Mm. Nice. 
plus 25% gold and 10% production in cities not on your original capital's continent. Native conquests. Yeah. Do we want to change policies? Nah. First we use these four. If we we'll to do that. Because now we can change the policy and throw this out and take nah, not the Raj. Uh, do this. in six turns and then four turns so let's go there and let's uh, put more pressure on the city what's with you how do you get there Let's promote you. Plus one to our combat strength. Mm, now we can do the enlightenment. The real use of gunpowder is to make all men tall. Really? We probably now can promote... We probably can now promote uh, these guys. Nah. Can we promote this guy? Yes. For night it was merely a curiosity of scholars. Now our musket men wield it as a weapon for the first time in the world. So we're the first musket men users. That's great. I believe. How about you? Can we update you? Nah. Of course not. Let's go up there. Mm, how about you? Too many units of the same class. How about you go in there? And you building a settler unit. Printing. Printing is good. Because the Forbidden City is a great wonder. It gives us one policy slot. The Joker policy slot even.
guys our thing going 1.75 yeah that's nice How about we becoming friends? I accept your offers of friendship and of course we'll be invited to the next royal wedding. That's good. Can we do an alliance then? How about an economic alliance? That's okay. That's acceptable. That's great. Ooh, Buenos Aires. Where is it? There it is. What do you want? Religious conversion. Blah. You will have met a new city state. What? Really? there as well. Let's kill another barbarian. build a city down there in the middle of the ice yeah why not so what do we want here we want another settler probably nah. another spy nah. Portola Palace. What does it do? Plus one diplomacy slot. Yay, I want the Portola Palace. Really? You'll have to build it on... Well, where, where do you have to build the Portola Palace? Must be adjacent to a mountain. Must be built on a hill adjacent to a mountain. Really? Ugh. Forget it. Let's build this. Build an industrial, build an encampment there. Can't we? Mm. Can we just, uh, I mean, kill this? <laughs> Best neighbors are distant ones. Right now, you are India's best neighbor. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Catherine finished. It is a beautiful something. and important monument and an international intercultural treasure. Unless and until it can be shared by both religions in harmony, which would be a grand idea. It should remain a secular building, 
honoring both religions who have made it beautiful. Mm -hmm. The Aya Sophia. I don't know if any one of you saw it already, but it's really, really a nice place, a nice building. Whatever is contrary to nature is contrary to reason. And whatsoever is contrary to reason is absurd. So, do we need the skyscraper still? We need probably this one still. And we want this one still. So we, we keep it like that. We get uh, Eureka for scientific theory. That's good. We were running low on that anyway. Why, why does this give us three error score and other other wonders like the Saint jo James of Saint George? Ah, no, like the. Whatever. Like the lighthouse only gave us one point. Hmm. Strange. Terracotta army. Oh, first one. So, where do we go? Let's go to. Again. He probably doesn't like us anymore afterwards. So Nah, I really don't want to build a city there. Do I? This is terrible. This is just ice and snow and stuff. So where was this? There's one. Uh, there it is. We'll take care of this. Really, Spain got some settlers to build a settlement here. I wanted to do this. So what do we do next? Do we do nationalism first? Probably better than the Clairvoy using a castle's belly. We won't do this because we want to play peacefully. Sophia and ooh, the Portola Palace. Where can we build him there? Let's build him there. Let's try to build him there anyway. Uh, Colosseum. Provides two of the following culture, loyalty per turn and amenities to each city center within six tiles must be built on a flat land adjacent to an entertainment complex within an arena. So we can build it only here and there. Six squares from here. One, two, three, four. That's inside. One, two, three, four, five. That's inside and this is also inside. And one, two, three, four, five, six. This is also inside, so this is a good place, I believe. Yeah, let's build it there. Down with the woods. Uh. 
we are building a lot of a lot of wonders right now so normally this should go up soon now really it still goes down <sighs> too bad it's in 41 turns we should go there next The Mapuche are trading with France. Hmm. How dare they! <laughs> you have completed your civilization. Uh, what? what? You've completed your civilization's first harbor with a starting adjacency bonus of four gold or higher. Really? Sailors and Dev doors shout and sing shanties all along the bustling wharves in the harbor of Piesif Avasis. This also brings free error score, that's nice. I mean, we wanted to do it anyway because of the uh, quest. If she did peace, when Yadari has made peace with Catherine the Medici. Splendid harbor completed. Great. Hmm. Shall we build a city there? I mean, shall we really do this <laughs> in the ice and snow? Normally only the computer does this kind of stupid things. Really? Musketeers? <laughs> Let's go to the sea again. Yay. 100 faith. Oh. That's not too much, but yeah, it's okay. Another great merchant gained 200 gold, gained two envoys. Yeah. Okay. Let's do this. Let's get some gold and some envoys. some zero envoy things. We now have a lot of uh, Mohenjo-Daro. We could become... Yeah, we will do one in Mohenjo-Daro at least. Antioch, train a cavalry. Pff. Hattusha, conversion. We have no envoys, only two each. Really? How can this be? We have two more city states. The rulers of Antioch bow to the Cree, who became their first sovereign in the world. Yay. Because we are so cool. Now, 
We could do a Tusa as well. And another two points. We are nearly done with this not getting a dark age. Statue of Liberty. What does this do? Grants two settlers. All your cities within six tiles are always 100% loyal. Must be built on the coast adjacent to land and the harbor district. Really? This is the place where we can build it. We can't build it there because uh, nah. also it's two hundred and eighteen turns. No. Nah. Of course not. <laughs> we'll build a lighthouse first because then we can get another trader. Down there it's better to build it like somewhere here. Okay, dear friends, that was my <coughs> um, this was my episode for today. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope we see each other again. Until then, see you next time. Bye. <coughs>